see they have gone through a lot of things. Six to eight months of taking intensive chemotherapy, on and off of the hospital, injections, fever, all those things. And when they come to this place, I could just see their face. It was totally lit up. They were so happy seeing, walking on the ground. And even now they're just awaiting when they want to meet the, all the players and have a walk with them. See, basically it's a very emotional touch when you work with kids. The main thing why we want to treat kids very aggressively is we treat them, there's a 90 to 95 percent chance that they get cured. So you will see a kid whom you have treated at two or three years, they grow up, they study, they get married, they will have their own life. So that's the main thing in treating this pediatric cancers because the ultimate thing is they are going to get cured. And we know they are going to get cured if they are properly treated. So that is the happiness. That happiness, I don't think any words can explain it. See, basically the main thing is I'm so happy that the kids have the opportunity to come and sit and watch thing, uh, the uh, football here and getting associated with the uh, BFC is a good thing for us because see, it's always like uh, it's a bond what they developed, whatever they have gone through for the last six months, maybe their minds will open, okay, let me play football, let me be with this. So there's a lot of positive vibes what they get when they come here and association with BFC. Special gesture as well as nine kids walk out with the Bengaluru side who have one fight unlike any other that life can throw at you. All nine are cancer survivors and the Bengaluru players and officials will also be seen wearing a ribbon to show their support for them, especially before the game.